Hi, good day. Welcome to CMS. Today we will continue our process in the quantity surveying, which is related to the MAP. We are talking about the infrastructure work, how CMS will deal with the infrastructure. When we click on infrastructure, CMS will guide us for a full POQ of infrastructure work, which is starting with soil investigation, demolishing for the existing, road construction, drainage, sewage, water supply, irrigation, electricity, road lights, telecom, and spare. At the end, we'll find the summary. We have a note here that all the rates which will be inserted here in this POQ, it will be the final price. That means you have to insert here the price which you will sell your project with, not only the cost, because this POQ is the final POQ which will be presented for the clients. So we'll follow now the steps, we'll go for step 1, which is click to run, step 2 to insert the necessary in the table, and step 3 is click to render. Let's start with click to run. It's done, and go for step 2. Step 2 here, we have to insert the necessary in the table. What the necessary to be inserted in the table? As you see here, the same is giving us full description for our requirement you can keep it the same or change according to your project specification and requirement you can change of course the rate according to the market rate and insert here the quantities accordingly same is will calculate the total amount for each division the same will be in the other division demolishing you can insert according whatever you need you can add rows and insert whatever you need to be calculated. The roads. Here is the, all the description for the road. Excavation, filling, pipes, works, and holes, ducts, protections, roads and paving, curb and channel, light duty pavement, and all the requirements for the road. So, same as give us the common description for the infrastructure work you can keep it or change it or modify according to your requirement change the the rate and the quantities as your requirements to add any rows of course you have to view the heading and insert any kind of rows as you like normal work in Excel the same for drainage same for sewerage all the requirements for the sewerage you can modify and add according to your requirement the same for the water supply and the irrigation electricity the road lighting the requirement for road lighting the telecom and the spare parts which you can be which you can provide for your project according to your project specification okay at the end you will have here a summary has the prices for all divisions and the total price remember this will be the final price to be presented for your client so you have to add here the price including your overhead the rate so the rates which you will provide here it shall be including your overhead after you add what's required or modify what you require it is not need to remove or cut whatever it's not whatever not used you will just after you finish your addition only you will make step three for rendering and to start render at the end you will have a full POQ for whatever activities and items which are needed only whatever not needed any activities or items not required or not needed that means you didn't put any rate or quantities for them it will be removed automatically that's how sim is dealing with infrastructure he give you a full ready view of queue you will just insert the quantities directly in it and when you are going when you are working in the cost estimation you will add your rate including your overhead and profits see you later in the next video thank you and goodbye